Hey everyone and welcome to the Showstopper Shows. You're here to see the toasted cheddar chalupa, right? Well, look at it. You just wanted to take a bite of it right there, didn't you? I know you did. Well, guess what I'm about to do? I'm about to take a bite of this. Let's do it. Raising the glasses for the masses. Look at that. Gotta have the napkins ready with this one, guys. What I'm about to do. Let's do something everybody wants to do. There it is. Inside, regular chalupa. Outside, toasted cheddar. Mmm. Crunchy. Aged six months, this is the new toasted cheddar chalupa. So basically it's a regular chalupa and it has cheese toasted on it. And it's not completely covered as you can see. It's kind of spotty and it comes off your fingers either like a breading on a chicken or even like a Cheeto. But it's not a Cheeto, it's cheddar cheese. But I gotta tell you my first reaction is when I taste it, it reminds me of almost like a burnt cheese flavor or like a really aged cheddar cheese and that's exactly what you're getting with that very strong very aged cheese it's almost bitter let me do one more taste yeah definitely a bitter flavor happening with that toasted cheddar lupa i like it it's new it's fresh it's it's it, it's exciting it's not chicken like the last couple of fun chalupas they've done which i liked both of those a lot especially the spicy one the naked chicken chalupas those are great that one's okay for me I have been a fan of the original Chalupa since way back in the day when I was a teenager working at Walmart and I would go and that was my favorite lunchtime menu item. And of course they were cheaper back then. I don't believe they had the boxes, but you get that combo for like five bucks and it was two Chalupas, a couple of tacos and a Baja Blast, which I got right here, all for like five bucks. Now they're like eight bucks, but good grief, that stuff is good. So how does that compare to a regular Chalupa? It reminds me of a regular chalupa except for the breading and the cheddar. And that actually is a little, it's not that great for me. It's a little bitter. Do I still like the original chalupa better than this? Yes, I do. I like the chicken, the naked chicken chalupas better than this one. If you love cheese and you like really old cheese, then you're gonna like this one. So what do I rate this? I'm gonna give that a showstopper mizzle for me, guys. It is a mizzle, I'm gonna give that about a 68, guys. A 68, it's just okay for me. Will I eat the rest of it? Yes, but I'm a little depressed. I wanted more of a cheddar cheesy flavor instead of that bitter cheese flavor. Guys, I'm thinking Kraft, I'm thinking Cracker Barrel, bars of cheese. I'm even talking like going to the deli and getting that special, really nice Wisconsin cheese. I'm not getting that from this, guys. I'm a little depressed. If that was like a Cheetos Chalupa, that would be on point, guys. And I like having orange fingers, and I'm not getting that today. It's just a, a toasted cheddar breading. <clears throat> all right, that's all for me. Uh, I'm going to do a video here probably soon of reacting to some comments that I've been getting because it's like it's so hard to just type things out, and then people can go read it and get the wrong idea. I just want to respond to a few and uh, I'm gonna get you soon too, good and bad. Thanks for watching, may the forks be with you, may the present be always. Put a bow on this a sure to go viral video because that's a wrap. The show stops here. Don't forget to subscribe. Go to my Instagram channel and tell me what you think about this as well. Was I way off base on this or were you like, dude, that was awesome. I don't know what you're talking about because I give you my honest opinion. I'm not here to lie. I'm not here, I'm not here to do anything but tell you if it's good or not. I'm not getting paid by Taco Bell. Would I do it if I was? I would still be honest. Show stops here. Never quit, y'all.